Hi everyone, welcome to this presentation. This is another video related to how to embed components in QSpice. In previous videos, we saw that from the description of a component in a Spice, we can create a single line, as shown here, that can be embedded in the QSpice component, so we don't need any other file to run our simulation. For this, from the description, we have to start with the pipe symbol and then copy all the lines separated by backslash n. So from this description, we have this definition in a single line. I think this is very interesting, very useful, because we can get rid of other files and have everything in a single file. But the problem is that it's a little bit cumbersome to generate this line. So I was thinking about how to do this automatically. I wanted to do this in a simple way so everyone can do it. I was thinking about using maybe a Python program or a C program or even a JavaScript program. But at the end, I decided that a good solution would be to use an Excel sheet to implement the necessary algorithm to transform the description of the component in multiple lines into a single line. So let's see how to do this. So this is the Excel file that we have created. We are going to copy the different lines of our model here. We have up to 1000 lines, but we could increase this if necessary in the same way. And here on the right, what we are doing is to use the concat function to add the backslash n at the end of the line. And we do this only if the line is not blank. If the line is blank, we just keep it blank. So we avoid having here backslash n if we don't have anything on this line. So for example, if I write here hello, then we can see that we have here hello backslash n. And then here in this line, we are going to have the result. So what we are doing is to use again the concat function with the pipe symbol and then adding all the lines that we have below from B3 to B1003. And then uh, on this line, we will have the information. So we only have to copy this line to our symbol. So for example, if we have this model, this subcircuit, then we only have to copy, control C, and then copy it here, control V, we say OK here. And then we have the same lines that we have here, but with the symbol backslash n at the end. And here in this line, we have the complete description of our model. So we only have to copy it and take it to our symbol in QSpice. So for example, as shown here, we have our symbol for the SCR, and instead of using a um, file to do the description we just delete this copy our complete description and here we have the complete definition of our component so we can save it and then we can use it we have here an example of using this component so if we select here the scr we can see the complete description and if we want to obtain the multiple line description so is to do the reverse process. We can go to view, netlist, and here we can get the description in multiple lines of our component. So we could do the other way. So from the single line, we can get the multiple line description just directly from QSpice. So now let's try this. We can run the simulation and here we have the results of the simulation so we can see that everything is operating correctly. Well, this is all today in this video. I will post this Excel file on my website. So if you are interested, you can download the file and use it directly. Please let me know if you have any comment or question. Thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye now.